Alrighty, hello guys, welcome you faces back to another Stormworks build and rescue video. Today we're actually uh, transporting this thing, which is an oops container, which weighs 2,500 whatevers. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and pick this thing up, we're gonna go ahead and put it on a container ship, and we're gonna truck it off. Uh, where does it have to go? It has to go to Spy Cakes, so um, that's where we'll go, yeah. Okie dokie then, so in order to actually do this then, we need to go ahead and get ourselves a thing that will move the container. Now if we go inside of here, uh, I believe we've got a thing called the Rat Cont G 100. Uh, and there you go, rat instead of cat. That makes sense, nice. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, figure this out. Power is on, let's go ahead and get inside. Uh, generator start override. Okay, I guess it automatically actually starts. Um, extend rear counterweights. Okay, that's for the cargo. Handbrake, how do I turn that off? One. Alright, here we go. So, I guess it's fully electric until the generator turns on by itself. So, let's go ahead and drive ourselves out of here. There we go. Awesome. Uh, we'll drive over to the container itself, and then we'll pick it up, and then hopefully, we'll be able to put it on the con container ship. Maybe. Alright, here we go. So, let's go ahead and turn the handbrake on as soon as we get pretty much level. There we go. Awesome. Uh, we need to figure out how this works. So this extends upwards and forwards. Okay, very nice. How do I expand the thing? Press 3. Oh, there we go. Alright, awesome. Press 1, drive forwards. Until we get, like, pretty much on top of this thing. There we go. Press 1 again. Jump outside. Turn on the connectors. There we go. Fantastic. Uh, and then we just have to lower it down. So, uh, press 1 again. There we go. How do I lower the winches? Uh, winch down. Here we go. Oh, there we go. Awesome. Winch is back up. That is pretty cool. Okay. Very good. Uh, we need to extend the counterweight backwards. How do I do that? Extend rear counterweights. There we go. Awesome. Uh, and we need to figure out how this works. So, I guess... How do I lift it? I don't know how I lift this thing. Uh... Yeah. I'm unsure. Boom retracted position lock. What? Oh, what? What? Boom out? No, do this, then this. This? Okay. No? No, maybe not that. <laughs> maybe not that. Bring it back in. What's this? Camera display. Oh, that's for connecting on. That makes sense. Alright, let's go ahead and just reverse it. This doesn't seem to be the right thing. Am I doing this wrong? I don't know. Okay, so the way that I'm seeing this, right, is if we go outside real quick, these are pistons, I believe, right here. So, they're pneumatic pistons, and they should, in theory, push up in order to actually raise that up above us. So, we need to figure out a key in order to actually uh, make that happen. So, uh, enable rear mags, we don't need that. Release, no, 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 no. Extend rear, no, that's alright. Expand container bracket, we've already done that. Release cargo, we don't need to do that. Pivot angle. Oh, here we go. There we go. So left and right is actually to lift it up and down. That makes sense. All right. So handbrake is off. Yes, indeed it is. Uh, we need to put it in reverse. And then we can go backwards. We'll go ahead and put this on the container ship. We got this. All right, here we go. So uh, the generator currently hasn't started. I'm not sure at what point it should start, but um, we'll go ahead and continue driving until it does. Or I guess this can get to like 50%, but... Uh, I don't think it's going to get that low. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's going to get that low, so I think we're okay. But anyway, we're driving. Uh, hopefully we are not going to tip over here. Oh! Oh! Oh god! Okay, we're good. We're good. This is fine. The counterweight is actually working out perfectly. That's good. Alright, let's go ahead and turn ourselves around. I know where the cargo ship is. It is actually here. Uh, it's just a very small one. Yeah. Alright, so before I show you guys the actual, uh, the actual boat, we're gonna go ahead and turn this on, because, uh, it needs to be able to attach, uh, which makes sense, and there's the boat right there, so, I'm assuming the boat is automatically on, however, I don't know, let's go ahead and jump down and see, uh, this presumably is it, unlock cargo container, unlock engine hatches, uh, flood risk, we don't need that, uh, deck lights, yeah, let's go ahead and put that on, actually, let's respawn this, so it's in the right place, and then we'll use it. Alright, there we go. Awesome. We won't turn the deck lights on. Let's just go ahead and see if we can actually put this on the boat. So press 1. Drive it forwards. Here we go. Uh, and this is going to be relatively tricky to do, I think. So we're going to get pretty close. And then we're going to turn on the handbrake. 
We're going to turn on the rear mags. All right, handbrake's on. Rear mags need to extend, and they're attached now. Awesome. Uh, we need to lower down the boom and also extend it somehow. How do I extend the boom? Boom out. Here we go. So, disable that. Boom out. There we go. Awesome. All right, keep it going out. And also lower it down. Oh, God. Okay, fantastic. Good. And then we need the winch to go down. All right, slower than that. Jesus. Oh. Oh, that's in about the right place. That's in about the right place. There's no way that's not connecting. Really? Do I have to drop it on? Do I have to drop this? There's no way. There's no way. Uh, should I unlock the, the things? Maybe that's the problem. I don't know. All right, let me on the boat. <laughs> let me on the boat, please. Here we go. Unlock the connectors. All right, I'm assuming that helps, but I don't know. Uh, and the boat is drifting away. Oh, God. Okay. Can I move the boat? Can I actually move the boat? I don't know. Uh, no. I don't think I can move the boat sideways. This isn't, this isn't working out. I can push it. I'm just going to push the boat. We're pushing the boat back into position. Don't worry. I need to close the door. There we go. That's all good. Don't you worry. <laughs> this is how you position boats. It does have thrusters on the sides. So there is a way of doing this from the inside. I just don't know what it is. So that's a thing. Anyway, push it forwards. Good. It should be low enough now to work. All right, keep pushing it sideways. That way. Go, go, go. You know what? I'm just going to disconnect this. There we go. We're on We're on the deck. We are on the deck. That's awesome. However, wait, 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 wait. Do this. Can I? Is it not attaching at all? Have I got any way of actually moving this around? Is that a winch? Ooh, I might be able to do something here. Hold on. We need, we need some... Oh, God, it's tipping. It's tipping. It's tipping. Oh, no. Really? Really? That sucks. How did I mess this up? I have no idea. All right, I just wanted to say if you guys have made it to this point in the video and you are actually enjoying it, please leave a like on the video down below. That would help me out a lot. Anyway, hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. All right, I've spawned it back in again. We're going to get ourselves a new container because we need one. Uh, and what we're going to do first then is we're going to lower the anchor down. Um, automatic anchor down. All right, there we go. It's going to connect itself to the floor. And hopefully that'll stop us from moving around. Yeah, that makes sense. Good. I do suppose it will give us a chance to actually use the electricity in this thing. So go ahead and put it in reverse. There we go. Awesome. It's got four-wheel steering too. That's pretty cool. Winches need to go up. All right, let's go ahead and have that start up. Press two again. Go forwards. Winch is up still. And the boom needs to come backwards. So uh, retract the boom and lock it in position. There we go. All right, cool. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I was expecting it to go a little bit better than this. Yeah. I was actually expecting it to go a lot better than this, to be fair. But uh, it hasn't, so never mind. We're drifting! Oh my god, you can actually drift this thing quite well. Uh, right, okay, so we need to figure out which one we need to take now. So let's go ahead and jump off and figure out which one we need. So Sawyer, no. Sawyer, no. Uh, Spike Cakes, we need this one. All right, come on, let's go. Um, all right, reverse, press 2. We got this. Okay, so extend the rear counterweights. That extends this thing on the back. That's awesome. Uh, we then want to winch down a little bit. Just a tiny touch. All right, good. We need to get ourselves in position. Right next to this thing. All right, here we go. Press 1. Very good. And attach it on. So enable this. Good. Lower the winches down. If I can. Uh, winches down. There we go. We're connected. Winch back up. Go ahead and lift it into the sky. And voila! There we go. Very good. All right. Whack it in reverse again. And go backwards. Is it working? Handbrake's on. All right. There we go. Reverse. Good. Oh, this is cool. I actually really like this thing. It, it works really well. I almost forgot to actually use the most important thing. Look, we got beacons on this thing. We've actually got beacons on the top of it. That's really cool. Uh, am I going to be able to dodge that? Uh, not really, but we can just keep pushing. Just keep pushing. There we go. All right, I think we're good. I think we're good. We did it. Okie dokie. So we made it to the bottom now. We just need to uh, to lower it down onto that thing. So we dropped the anchors on that, obviously, uh, as you guys already seen. Uh, we just need to be able to place this on there and hopefully have a good time with it. But I, I don't know how to do that. I'm not going to lie. All right, here we go. We're going to get really close to the edge. Press 1 to stop us. 
Go forwards a little bit more. Press 1 again. Okay, very good. Then we need to um, rear mag. There we go. So it locks us to the floor. That makes sense. Very good. Uh, and then we need to extend it out. So turn that off. Boom out. Very good. Lower it down a lot. Oh, oh, oh. I think I'm breaking the thing. Oh, God. No, extend it up a little bit. Just a tiny touch. There we go. Uh, lower this down. Okay, we're in the wrong position. We are in the wrong position. I repeat, wrong position. All right, keep war in the world. What is going on, boys? All right, no, this is fine. <laughs> this is fine. It's okay. Uh, how do I do this? Um, Is there any rope inside of here? I feel like I need rope. I feel like I really need some rope. We got these little connectors all around, but I got no rope. Uh, any rope inside of here? Where's the rope at? I need rope. There's no rope. They're empty. Where's the rope? Where's the rope? There is none. There's no rope in this thing. I need it, though. I need the rope. All right, open the cabin. Oh, wow. It brings us into here. That makes sense. All right, close that up. Is there any rope? Is there any? I don't think there is. This is annoying because it's so close, but it's so far away. All right, turn this on. Okay. Good. Uh, right, um, uh, I don't know what to do. I need some rope. I found it. There's a, there's a cupboard here called cables and ropes. There we go. All right, give me, give me a rope. There we go. Equip the rope. Do we have anything that could pull on this side? We don't. Damn it. Um, okay, let's attach this to here. And this to where? There. Okay. Doesn't really help, does it? That didn't really do much. All right, attach that to there and then there. Okay, cool. Attach this to here and then here. Maybe. Does that help at all? I don't think it does anything. It doesn't do anything. All right, so since we still got this in the sky, I can actually still push it around. However, it is not connecting to the floor. It's just not. So I'm not. I'm not sure what to do with that. Information right there. I don't know. Uh, all right, push it, push it, push it. All right, disconnect it from here, and then reattach it. <gasps> oh, that puts us in a better position. Yes. All right, of course it does. That's good. All right, and push this this way. Oh, oh, we did it. We're attached. All right, disconnect this thing. Yeah. No, that's 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 normal. Good. All right, we're attached. Good. Okay, so with that done then, we can actually get inside of here, and uh, we can just go do our business. So, we're going to Terminal Spy Cakes, which is literally just over there. Let's see how this boat deals with that. So, navigator helm. Here we go, we're on the helm. Uh, we have engine start right there. Okay, very good. Navigation displays, helm displays. Very good. There's uh, Terminal Komodo right there, that's awesome. Uh, we can actually do ballast tanks if we need them, which I don't think we do. Uh, auto leveling system, let's go and put that on. Uh, front spotlights, running lights, there we go. Exterior lights, very good. Rear spotlights, cargo deck spotlights, there we go. Cargo weight capacity equals 2,500 pounds. If container is over, ensure only 50% fuel. Interesting. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put in a waypoint, which is actually going to be that way. So, over here somewhere. Let's go ahead and set a waypoint. Very good. Go ahead and put this in. Whack that in. And... I guess we'll automatically go that way. All right, here we go. Set the throttle to a lot. Very good. Uh, engage autopilot. Okay. Is that working? I'm not sure. I don't know how to get this thing working. Night vision, we don't need that. Uh, nose up and down, we don't need that. Can we just go? I don't know how to go. All right, I've turned off the autopilot uh, thing. What just happened? Oh, we have our anchors down. I forgot about that. All right, we've uh, we've engaged the boat. It's now going. It's very weird, but I like it. It's so cool. Okay, right, go, go, go. So we're going to go ahead and deliver this thing. We don't actually have a vehicle at the other side that can lift it off. Uh, but the whole point of this was actually to check how this thing works. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and spawn in some waves and stuff like that. And I guess we'll see how that goes. All right, so we're doing it the way that I test most vehicles, and that is 25% wind. Uh, and this is what we've actually ended up with. This is 25% wind, 
It is seemingly doing everything completely fine, which is awesome. Uh, and yeah, it is actually completely fine here. It's a bit wobbly, not gonna lie. But I think it sorts itself out a little bit, which is awesome. Alright, so as you guys can see, I have increased the wind speed to uh, 50. And um, yeah, we're a little bit more, a little bit more out of control. Let's go ahead and slow down. Uh, a lot. <laughs> Let's go ahead and slow down a lot, if I can. I don't seem to be able to slow down. Can I turn that off? There we go. Because the autopilot seems to be doing something. Even though it's not engaged. Uh, so that's a thing. Um, yeah. I don't know what's going on there. I don't know how to stop this boat. Oh, there we go. It's W and S. I don't know. For some reason, I was pushing up and down. Anyway, uh, we're going to go ahead and still keep going. That makes sense. Uh, but we should really... I don't know what's going on there. Our RPM's too high. We should really uh, sort this out so that it's a little bit better. But never mind. Uh, what's that? Oh, okay, so this is like engine. All right, good. This is the radar. All right, that makes sense. And then this is the rear camera. Okay, good. Probably want to work on the engine for now. But yeah, this is 50%. So let's go ahead and increase this to 100. Let's just go straight to 100. All right, here we go. Straight to 100%. And we have taken off. Uh, we're, now, we're now in the water. We just need to slow down a lot. Oh, no, we actually way too little. <laughs> oh, God, no. We've tipped over. We, we weigh too little for 100% wind. That ain't it. That ain't it. No. Oh, God. And now we're just stuck upside down. Tsunami? I guess we're going to have to. Okay. So, I guess if you do get caught out in this thing, uh, and you do end up upside down, um, just don't worry about it. As long as you got the door closed, you're completely fine. You will survive. Um, at least a little bit. We do have engine failure, but uh, that is because we're upside down. Um... And I would assume that this little container actually weighs quite a lot compared to the boat. Uh, so, yeah. Um, oh, air high ships are going over the tsunami currently. That one is going to challenge it, apparently. Um, all right, we're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, let's just watch this one, see how it goes. Because I'm assuming that it will survive, but I don't know. It's almost at it. Oh, it's, it's being picked up. It's being picked up. It's sinking a little bit. No, it's fighting back. It's underneath. No, it's fighting back. It's going over the top. It's flying. It's... That boat seems okay. That's awesome. Nice. All right, time for us then. So, we're going to have to turn on the engine uh, as this happens and hope for the best with that. Perfect. All right, come on. I should maybe uh, actually put the anchor on the floor. That would probably help. Flip us over. I'm not sure, though. All right. Here we go. Here we go. We're going to try and start the engine as soon as we get in the sky. Unless it flips me automatically anyway. Don't know if it will. Will it even toss me into the sky? Oh, I'm not sure now. I'm not sure if we're ever going to... Are we going over the top? No, we got this. We got this. Come on. Flip us about a little bit. No. Oh, I thought it was going to do it there. It didn't do it. It didn't do it. Damn it. That sucks. That sucks, I don't know what to do. Full wind? Full rain? I think we're stuck upside down. I think this is us now. We're dead. I can never do a normal delivery, can I? It just it just never happens. Um, I'm thinking if we do just, just like turn this off, wait for a big old wave to happen again, and then turn it on again. Okay, we're the, we're the right way up. I'm gonna go ahead and turn the wind off now, turn the rain off now, and go back to normal. Okay, so... Um, don't go with 100% wind, unless you are entirely sure how this thing works. Because it's very complicated. Oh, it's quite complicated on the inside. Uh, auto-leveling depth. We've got depth right there. We've got waypoints. We've got autopilot dis delays, which is interesting. Uh, we've also got an emergency, which is flares. Interesting. Uh, but yeah, we're good now. We're, we're going to continue moving. Also, let's open this door up. I should turn that light out. Um... Unlock engine hatches. Let's go to the back and see what the engines look like. Here we go. Generator hatches. Here it is. I can't actually seem to get in there, but there's the engine. Nice. All right, close the door. Uh, generator hatch. There we go. Nice. That is cool. That is actually really cool. Okay, so this is actually going to be a delivery to uh, here instead. So we're going to set this as a waypoint. Uh, we're going to deliver it to the beach, and hopefully we're going to be okay. So the way that this is going to work then... So we're going to detach this from there. Attach it onto there. 
attach it onto here. Oh no, we can't. Attach it onto here. There we go. Awesome. We're gonna winch out. Okay. Good. We're then gonna go back to the front. We need- oh no, we need to detach this one too. There we go, detach that. Floor it. Floor it, go, go, go. Oh, this isn't gonna work. This isn't- no. No, don't do what I was saying. Don't do what I was saying. I wanna drop it off the back and like, deliver it to the land. That's my- that's my plan anyway, but I don't know if that'll work. There's no Passover point there, is there? No, there's no way. Not with this thing anyway. Damn it. Wait, what's going on around here? There's a flare. What is this? We've pretty much ended up at Terminal Spy Cakes anyway. Wait, there's a boat on fire. We need to do a rescue. <laughs> we need to do a rescue with this boat. All right, hold on. Hold on, everything's gonna be okay. Anchor drop down. Okay, jump out. We need to do a rescue. Uh, drop this on the floor. Give me this. Let's go, go, go. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry. The, uh, the tiny container ship is here to rescue you. Kind of. All right, I think we do actually have everything on board. In order to rescue these guys. That's so weird. That's really weird. Alright, so we're just going to continue. We're going to put this thing out. And uh, hopefully these guys can all be rescued by someone else. I mean, I guess we could put them on board. I don't know. Do we want them? I don't think we want them. I'm going to put out this fire. It's right here. It should be out now. Is it out? It's not out yet. I don't think this fire will ever go out. It doesn't seem like it anyway. Please? No? It's not going to work. It's not going out. Please? I'm now dying of fire. I can't put this fire out. What in the world? Why not? All right, there we go. After running around just squirting this thing with uh, with with foam, I guess uh, everything's okay. Right? Come on, come on, come on. We we are rescuing. Actually, no. You guys can all stay on the boat. That's fine. You get on the boat. You get on the boat. We can actually just tow the boat because reasons. We'll just tow them to the harbor with uh, everyone else. That makes sense, right? I think. Here we go. Get back on here. Yep, there we go. Put you in a seat. Grab this guy. Put you in a seat. Come on. There we go. Put you in a seat right there. And then we need some rope. Attach this to there and then we're good. Alright, fire extinguisher. You guys might need that. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, and we'll sort this out. So, grab this. Attach it to there. Swim back over to this thing. We'll grab it. And we'll take them to the port. It's just there. Okie dokie, we're attached via a winch. That's awesome. Let's go ahead and get going. Uh, I actually turn this on to off too. Lift that up. There we go. Turn the engine back on. And off we go. Alright, this thing pulls that thing effortlessly. That is awesome. We are actually going to pull them in a little bit too, because reasons. So, let's go backwards and we'll pull them in. What is this? Bridge lights. I didn't even see that. Okay, we're going to pull them in a little bit. Here we go. Winch in. Come on over. Nice. We did a rescue, as well as, like, bringing a container to the, to the container place. That's awesome. Tiny container ship does awesome rescue. All right, okay, so we're going to continue going forwards. Uh, I am going to turn out the lights if I can. I don't know how to do that. Cargo deck spotlight. Turn that off. How do I turn them off? How do I turn them off? Exterior there we go. And um, there we go. We did it. That's awesome. They can count themselves rescued. Yeah. Nice. All right, cool. Well, anyway, uh, I think I'm actually going to end this video here for now. Uh, you can unload this thing with the thing that we actually picked it up and dropped it onto the boat with. Uh, but we won't be doing that today because uh, reasons and things. But anyway, uh, if you guys do want to use this thing, I will link it down below. If you guys want to use the crane thing as well, I'll also link that down below as well. Uh, they were both actually built by the same person. So, um, yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you in the next one. Goodbye.